What would happen if you were suddenly transported to the surface of the sun, even for just one second? It sounds impossible, but let's imagine the consequences. The sun's surface, called the photosphere, burns at about 5,500 degrees Celsius. That's hot enough to vaporize steel instantly, let alone human skin. Before heat even reaches you, the sun's intense radiation would shred your cells. Ultraviolet, X-rays, and gamma rays would fry your body in microseconds. In less than a tenth of a second, your body would evaporate into gas. Faster than you could even realize what's happening, you'd simply vanish. Could a spacesuit save you? Not at all. Even the best suit would melt instantly. There's no material on Earth strong enough to protect you here. But let's bend the rules. Suppose you could somehow survive that single second on the sun. What would really happen to you and the star beneath your feet? The sun's surface isn't solid at all. It's a sea of plasma. Standing on it would be like trying to balance on a boiling ocean made of fire and charged particles. At these extreme temperatures, every molecule in your body would fall apart. Cells would burst instantly, and even your DNA would unravel into pure atoms. Even if heat didn't reach you right away, the invisible radiation would. Ultraviolet, X-rays, and gamma rays would rip through your body with devastating force. A single second doesn't sound like much, but here it's an eternity. In just a tenth of that time, you'd already be gone, long before the clock strikes one. Could technology help? Imagine building the strongest metal platform to stand on. In reality, it would melt and sink instantly, dragging you down with it. In truth, there's no possible way to survive. The sun's energy output is beyond anything we can imagine. For a human, even a fraction of a second means total destruction. In reality, even imagining standing on the sun reveals just how fragile humans are compared to cosmic forces. We are nothing against its blazing power. Our planet protects us. Earth's atmosphere and magnetic fields shield us from deadly radiation, turning a cosmic furnace into life-giving sunlight. On Earth, sunlight gives warmth, energy, and life. The same star that would instantly destroy us also allows us to exist in the first place. The sun is both a destroyer and a creator. It's a paradox of nature. Without it, we wouldn't survive. Yet getting too close means instant death. And our sun is only one of billions. Every star is a potential furnace, but also a potential cradle for worlds and life we can only imagine. So in the end, a single second on the sun is impossible. But thinking about it shows us the delicate balance that makes our own existence possible.